We're live and on the air. Hey everybody, Eric here with 365 here, and I am back with another live stream. I haven't streamed in a while, and I figured I'd do it tonight. Tonight I am playing one of my personal favorites, Until Dawn. In our last episode, Chris was going into the lodge, and he was going to open the door to the lodge. So let's have some fun. Time to get scared. <laughs> Don't you guys think this is a little bit... Oh, come on. She deserves it. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. No! Shut up! <laughs> First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Son of a bitch! So, I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Boom. Butterfly, Butterfly effect. effect. Okay. On to the adventure. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Cochise, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. Absolutely not. Hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. attention in climbing class you mean Jim yeah you know with the climbing up the rope well did I do that I, I don't think so here use this whoa Chris I just got an awesome idea yeah totally well, what, what is it okay so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the Lormy dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. He's a good actor. I like him. Especially when he was in Bohemian Rhapsody. Oh, 
forgot how big this lodge is. Okay, what have we got over here? Huh. That's cool. The Washington family. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be like getting the lock open or something? <laughs> On it. I just thought I'd have a little fun. Okay, I'm pretty sure I have a glass break. One new message. New message. Hi, Mrs. Washington. This is Sergeant Tate again. It's bad news, I'm afraid. Yeah, we've been through the case files, and there's nothing we can do. He's a free man. We don't have the legal power to restrict his movement. Uh, I know it's not what you wanted to hear, so call me if you want to know more. End of messages. Buns off out here.
bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire to go. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Make yeah. yourself at home, bro. Will do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa. It's easy there, cowboy. Mike, stay away from our girlfriend. Dude, what are you talking about? Stay away from Emily. Emily? Why would I want anything to do with Emily? <laughs> Quit being such a dick, man. Nobody wants you here. Seriously, what's your problem, you meathead? Son of a bitch! Hey, hey, get off me! Hey! What the hell is wrong with you two? We didn't come back here just to tear each other's heads off. I mean, we came. Back here to have a good time, right? Hey, Mike, why don't you and Jess go check out the guest cabin I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, cool. You wanna head up there? Sure. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my God, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my God, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Whoa. Do you? I guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Is your fight uh, scene for the night? Exiled. Sexiled. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, bar. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right, and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars! You're gonna need these. Porn star? I'd pay to see it. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. You gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. Next time I get the camera, okay? Well, okay, but 
It's not easy holding the thing all like backwards and forwards at the same time. <laughs> okay, let's go. I've got cabin fever. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Now, that's something I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. muscle flexing back there with you and Matt. What a dick, right? Dude has no business coming at me like that. If he's got any brain and that huge dumb melon, he better find it and use it or he's gonna get wrecked. Wow. Nasty Mikey. Just riled up. Me likey. Nice one, Mikey. Sam, the gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. No, this is awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hit. <laughs> you psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. Wow. Police? From Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Well, wherever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. That's a nice way of thinking about it. hear that? I heard something. Yeah. Can't say anything. Damn. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with the path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka wax museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. We're adventurous. We will find another way around. Crap, she's 
scare the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. All right, coming after you. Just stay put. Hey, handsome. Want to help me move this cart thing? with Jessica is full. Alright. How am I moving? How am I moving? I imagined us grunting together. This is not what I pictured. <laughs> This is like historical. Holy bat cave. It's gotta be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> no, no, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? Well, you said holy bat cave, so I'm guessing Batman. Huh. It's a doggy. Kidding. Weird place to hang out and smoke cigars. <laughs> it's recent. I wonder who is up here. Fixer rubber. something this way. Don't really 
this circle. Some things I remember, some things I don't. Josh said cabin, I thought like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stumps. Oh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Uh, whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Answering his mating call. Wow, you're easy. Yeah, you've got a lot of love to give. <laughs> I'm scared. Josh, couldn't you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half-empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. <laughs> oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. That's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> yes!
Hannah's. All Hannah's stuff. Or Hannah, sorry. Hmm. Happy Christmas 2010, sis. Love, Josh. Thought it looks familiar. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure that somewhere in this crazy place we used to have a spirit board. A what? Wow, you have a spirit board? <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're fun, right? Wait, are you saying we should have a seance? Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well, Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah, Ooh, yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys, see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um, okay. Guess so. Brad, I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over, you know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> Go in this room. 
I cannot. You know, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... Uh, what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this, together. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Sorry to drag you down into the bowels. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. It's mine. I used to play ball with my dad all the time. Of course, that was before he got too busy to hang out with me. Ah, well, save it for the couch, right? Okay, let me see what I can do with this old hot water machine. Butterfly effect. Here, can you, can you hold this? Nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. First point. Does it start at 30? No, 15. Oh. Oh, more of a ping pong now. <laughs>
what? The rhythm is like weirdly regular. Not, not, nothing regular about it. about to burst or some problem with the furnace. Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you... are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master! Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh! What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're going to take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just... Been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. like to understand your feeling toward people who fear failure and worry about what others think of them. Do you share this fear? Yeah. And how do you feel about people who are afraid? I see, well, Emily has quite a fear of failure. Do you feel bad for her? No. Indeed, that is apparent from the choices you've made. resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty then? And charity? Charity. 
Such a giving and caring person. Very nice. Huh? Well, again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Today is the one-year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. Oh, son of a bitch! Boom. Butterfly effect. Hey! Hey! Get off me! Hey! What the hell is wrong with you two? Hey, Mike, why don't you and Jess go check out the guest cabin I told you? Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> yes! So, it says here, Chapter to three. communicate Haunt. with the spirit world, you must Eight free your mind. Visions and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since you're a recent convert, why don't you be our medium? Okay, um, is anyone there? Will you reveal yourself to us if you're there? <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Holy shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. Who are you? Oh, oh here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? Who's sister? Oh, come on. Is this for real? Shut up. Ask it who's sister. Josh, it's... It's gotta be. Yeah, okay, well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. Who are we speaking to? Beth? Is that you? Oh, God. <laughs> this is messed up. Josh, are you? Fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No. Dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If, if this is actually Beth, I mean, we, we can find out what happened that night. Okay. Um, let me think. Beth, we want to know what happened to you that night. Can you tell us? H A N N. It's spelling Hannah. Wait, it's still going. K I L L. Oh my God. Killed. Guys, guys, what's she talking about? I don't know if I can keep doing this. We have to. Just, just, just stay calm. I, I think it's saying that someone killed Hannah. I don't know. I just a ask it something else. Who was it? L I B The library. Maybe there's something in the library e here. R O O Proof. There there's there's proof. In the library. Oh, no. oh. Holy shit. Chris. 
You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no! You wanted to use the spirit board! Hey, hey calm down. It's, it's not actually fault. I don't need this right now, okay? You guys are full of it. Should we go after him? Ah, man, I'm... I mean, he'll be okay. Let's... Let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. I mean, if, if you were faking it, if you were doing one hell of a job... I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. I mean, that was me who viewed stuff. Yes? <laughs> yes! No, you're right. It's hello. Danger. Jess? Hun? Light of my life? Seriously? This is not funny. Ah! Whoa! Christ! I scared the blue out of my jeans. What the hell is that doing in there anyway? I don't know, but that mask is pretty cool. I totally promise I won't murder you when I find you. Oh! oh my god. No. <laughs> that was so good. Not, no. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You had to see those. You had to I'm not look, seeing it. No. 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 <laughs> you recorded that? <laughs> look at your face. <laughs> I was scared, oh Jed. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's scary. I'm sorry to scare you. If we send that to anybody, you know what? Gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you scared the pants off of them. As far as I can tell, my pants are still on. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Looks like you have to try harder. A challenge, eh? Well, I hope you're strapped in, because you're about to feel the full force of my mind melting thrill skills. Is it 
someone screaming? No. No. Uh, probably just a squirrel. Freak town. <laughs> Charming. It's everything you described, Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. This flesh. Not the cabin. Well, I mean, technically it is a cabin, but not the cabin. I guess that's the only thing in here is this. Okay. Okay, that would be good for a jump scare. What is that? I'm not sure I want to know. Buddy. God, the poor thing. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Mike, it's in so much pain. It'll be over soon. Okay, buddy. It'll be over soon. Go. I am! <sighs> Mike! 
bullshit! No, 100%, 100%, 110%. <sighs> Holy crap, I feel like I just ran a marathon. I think we kind of did. Was it a bear? Yeah, gotta be. Things are crazy fast. I mean, I didn't see it. Hey, things are not gonna come barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Because I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay, well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. I promise you that no bear or anything else is gonna open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Urgh. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. Mike. Yeah. Fire and mood lighting. Yes. Nice. This will lighten up the mood a little. Pun intended. Oh! Ah! Hey! What? Are you okay? What are you doing? It's... It's the lights. I know it's the lights, dummy. You broke them. But it's probably faulty wiring or something. You've got faulty wiring. That's not nice. I suggest you get a fire going pronto. Just a second. Have patience. Oh, hell yeah. These guys were inventive. Whoa. I'm not sure if I'm ready for such advanced levels of game play. Yay, you're being punny. God damn it! Get off, get off, get off! Ah, 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 oh, fuck, shit, fuck, fuck, shit. What do you think was in there, Mike? Come on. get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll have you look for it. It's got to be outside. Yeah. I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. <sighs> Fine. Looky, looky. Who's going to fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? 
No. Yes. That was on behalf of Mike. Oh, Jess. Look at this. Is it a fire? No. Way cooler. understand what we have together. to your flagpole. Looks like we weren't the only ones to meet the friendly neighborhood terror bears. That does not make me feel any better. All right. Wait, what am I apologizing for? Right. I've looked around long enough. Come on. Ah, this will take care of the mood lighting. Fire zero. Very nice. A bravo. All right, my lady. What comes next? I think. Well, I I wish we had some booze. Uh. Well, uh, if I'd have known that ahead of time. I don't know. I'm kind of just. I'm not feeling it yet. Am I doing something wrong? No, 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 no. I mean, I thought you were one way, but you're kind of another way. Does if that make sense? It's, it's not your fault. Uh, Jess, I really like you. Whoever you think I am, well, just give me a chance, and I will show you what you need. Well, I am liking your confidence. Mike, the shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please. <laughs> There's just no one out there. I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Yes, really. It's fine. <laughs> I really don't like it. Okay, shutter it is. Shutters are shutted. Now, where were we? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I think I'm a little freaked out, and it's hard for me to, like, keep this up, and... What? Keep, keep what up? Look, I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, I gotta be honest, I am really kind of insecure. You've got to be kidding me. What? You have nothing to be insecure about. Oh, <laughs> you have no idea. Sure I do. You're just like me and everyone else. We're all insecure. But you know how to handle yourself. You might call it a front, but it's real. Yeah, I guess I do. Yeah, and that's super fucking hot. 
Really? Yeah, hell yeah it is. Come here. Maybe I know how to handle you too. I am definitely ready to be handled. It's your phone. What? How is it my phone? I don't know. It just came through the window. Oh, for fuck's sake. God damn it. What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business. they were if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. Okay, what do we have here? Josh looked really freaked out at the seance. Yeah, I mean, he, he, he looked like he was keeping it together, but... Do you think we shouldn't have mentioned his sisters? I mean, it's why we came back up here. Yeah. But not to, like, have a seance. Maybe we went too far. Whoa. Did, did you see that? Yeah. The, the power's not even on. Weird. That's a good question. Should I push it? That's what buttons were for, I guess. Whoa, that opens. That explodes. Are we, like, in a movie right now? If we are, I hope it's a rom-com. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house? I mean, maybe they didn't even know. This place is super old. So, should we take a look? Yeah, after you. No, 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 no. You go. Gee, thanks. I don't know, Chris. Not that way. This way. Oh, there's a book. Whoa. What? Whoa, 
is this? What did you find? Holy cow. Now, now Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but, but look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I... I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. The clue? Yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. It's a, a threat. Chris, this is serious. We need to find Josh right now. was actually after Hannah and Beth? If so, that would be really messed up. Looks like it was written by Josh's mom. Yeah, she's really making an effort to set things right with some native tribe or something. Yep, the bad karma goes back a long way. saw earlier with Sam. What? It, there was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know? So? And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? There was a message on this answering machine I found and it, it, it was from this sergeant saying that there was this guy who had just got out of prison and that there was nothing he could do. Well, what do you mean? He was saying it like, like a warning. I mean, maybe that's whoever was down in the basement before. What? Under the floorboards in the library, the light. Well, there was that guy I told you well, about. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. I mean, he, he said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris, if this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. You hear that? That was Josh! Coming from the kitchen. Josh! Josh! Coming! Hold on! Ashley! Ashley, what's going on? Coming in! Ashley! I'm gonna... Ash? Ash! I'm going to show you some uh, pictures of people that you have come to know. Maybe you'd 
don't like them as much as you pretend to. Well, this is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time, your answers are important. One individual we're considering as a person of interest. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. Apparently, he had warned them against pursuing their construction project in Blackwood Pines and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. S. I. S. T. Sister? Ask it whose sister? Josh, it's it's gotta be. Which sister is it then? Ah! Run! Ah! Oh. oh my god. Ash! Maybe I know how to handle you, too. I won't murder you when I find Watch out, Bird Brain. Alright, that's that. Alright, uh, like I said, I will be back on either later today or later tomorrow to finish the stream. And then I will be doing Final Fantasy VII! Yay! Super excited about that. Uh, I was the viewer earlier because I. That's apparently how I get messages when I play Until Dawn. Anyway, uh, if you guys do watch later, uh, thank you guys for watching. If you guys want, you guys can like, subscribe, leave your comments below, and I will see you in the next video. Until then, this is Eric Yorworth365 saying. See you guys later.